Hey guys, it's Lightning Flash here and it is day three of having the Cornish Cross Chicks. I have some bad news to go over in this video, so without further ado, let's get into the bad news. All right, so before we get into the bad news, I put this up right here to keep them a little warmer, to keep the light in, to keep eh, heat in, since this goes down, this is helping it catch heat a little bit to keep them warm. First thing I wanna go and say is this light yesterday, when I came down here, I said I was gonna go away for a little bit. Went away for a few hours, came back and the light was off and the chicks were cold. Obviously, they all look fine, but that's, that's bad news right there. But that's not what I would like to um, say. That's not, the, that's not the bad news. The bad news is there's a chick in here that is very, very, very small compared to the others. It hasn't grown since I got them. This one right here is getting huge. A huge birdie. That one's getting huge. This one's big. No problem with them. It's starting to like try to fly. But the bad news is this little one back here, right here, is so tiny compared to all the others and has not grown at all. This little baby right here has not grown not grown at all it still eats and drinks but it's very 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 tiny and I'm worried about it so like here is a size comparison you see how big this chick is and then how tiny this one is this is not good I'm very worried about this chick and hope it does not die which it could very well this one obviously is getting huge but that one is not looking too good it's still eating though which not having a problem eating, so I am not sure. <sighs> really hope it gets bigger, but it has not grown since I got it. All these other ones are doing great, but this one is still lagging behind. Not sure exactly what to do. Obviously, I'm going to get this filled up in a minute and get new water. Let's just hope for the best for that little chick. All right, so let's come down here. Take a scoop of this feed right here. Fill this thing up. Maybe, maybe the big little, little chick will get bigger if it has, it sees this nice fresh food and just digs in. That's good enough. I don't want to put too much in because I don't want to waste it. Like if they poop down in it, that would make a mess. So you don't want to put too much in it, but you obviously want to have a good amount. I won't have to fill this up till sometime tomorrow. As for water goes, it is nasty. Time to be dumped. And this, obviously, this tray under here is going to have to come out like we've done for the last two days. Okay, chick. I'm sorry, but i got to take your water away. Because it's nasty. Alright, I got the food and water in here. Like I said, the little one is eating. It's just... Not very big. <laughs> it's so tiny compared to the other ones. Um, yeah, there's another one that's kind of small, but it's not as nearly as small as this little guy right here. Um, I'm really hoping the chick pulls through and gets bigger. Not sure if it will or not. Um, maybe it's not going over to the food enough because when I put it over at the food, it eats. So, not sure what's happening there. Yes, it can get its head down in there enough. Sometimes I just push it over to make sure it's make it a little easier. But I don't know. I don't know why it's not growing compared to the other ones. Like, you, see, you can see right there how small it is compared to the other ones. Not sure those three are still under the light. But I'm hoping the, the little baby pulls through and gets bigger. Time for me to go dump this nasty tray. All right, so let's go dump this crap in the garden. You can tell these chicks are healthy when you see all this nice crap in here. Don't really see much diarrhea. See a little bit of diarrhea. Don't know which one's that's coming from. Just... Dump it here in the garden. Let's head back inside and finish this video up. Okay, so I got the got the tray cleaned out on here and put new grass in it. One thing I am regretting though is not getting the other um the other three Cornish cross chicks that were there. I grabbed ten. I should have got extra ones just in case obviously one died. 
I don't know how this little one right here is going to do. It's going to recover or not. I just have no idea. The other ones though all seem doing like they're doing really good. It's just that that one little one. I mean, it's eat, I stuck it over here and it ate fine. Ate for a minute then left. So I I don't know. Kind of confused. I've never I've had chicks. This is my like third time. I haven't had this problem before with like a slow grower. Maybe it'll catch up. Hopefully it catches up. But if it if it dies, that's just a part of this. Just gotta be ready to lose it even though it'll be sad. All right guys, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Let's hope that little chick pulls through. I like that sound. Let's hope that little chick pulls through. Um, hope you guys are enjoying the series. Don't forget to drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Hit that notification bell so you can keep up to date. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe. We have fun here. Okay. And watch that playlist wherever it may be. Keep it electrified. And I'll see y'all later.